Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. I hope you guys are all doing well. So today, um, as you can tell from the title, we're gonna go do some thrift shopping because I haven't done that in a while and I wanna see what I can find. And it's just better than always buying new stuff, you know? So yeah, I'm gonna head out, um, but let's first make lunch. Okay guys, can you believe the day has come where I'm working with Hello Fresh, like, I never thought I'd see the day, but you, if you guys have been following me for a while, you know that I absolutely love HelloFresh. And um, yeah, they're kindly sponsoring this portion of the video and we're gonna cook some lunch. I mean, to this day, I have learned so many recipes from HelloFresh. I use, I keep my recipe sheets and I redo them. Um, and I like that there's flexibility to order boxes whenever I want or need, just if I need to like save a lot of time during the week. So the recipe that I've chosen um, for today is a Thai style pork rice bowl, only 30 to 35 minutes because I need to make a quick lunch. So let's make this. So if you're new to HelloFresh, they basically provide a wide variety of recipes with ingredients delivered to your door. Honestly, HelloFresh makes cooking easy and affordable with meals starting from £3.50 per serving and that's without a discount, guys. You get to choose your meals and they provide you with these easy to follow step-by-step -step recipe cards, which I like to keep and reuse. And I swear, every time I'm left with a delicious meal that's budget-friendly and was super easy to make. It just makes my life so much easier. I can pre-plan what we're having for the week. So I don't even have to stress about that. And what's even better is that your plan is flexible. You can skip weeks or cancel your subscription at any time. To top this all off, I have a discount code for you guys. It's Anushka60 and that will give you 60% off your first box and 25% off this next two box plus free gifts. I mean, that's an amazing deal, guys. Definitely give it a go. I'll leave the link in the info box. Give it a try and let me know what you guys think in the comments below. We just got to Kingston and yeah, I need to find some shops that I can visit. I'm just gonna randomly walk around and see if I find any. We're gonna stop for a quick coffee here. I hope there's space. I've got the Spandaula, which is like my favourite from Uno Is that the custard one? Mm. This is just what I needed, coffee. Can I get a yellow dragon fruit, please? Only cash, four pounds, please. Oh yeah, I've got cash. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Why should I ask you yellow dragon fruit? Hello. Why should I ask you? Yeah, yellow. The sweet one is so nice. So yeah, I was buying the dragon fruit from him and it goes Eid Mubarak. Okay, this is the first charity shop we're coming into okay. now. Oh my god. Look at all these blue tops. Oh, five pounds. I'm trying to find like the label. I'm definitely going to get this jumper. There's some Stradivarius jeans, but size 10. I'm no longer size 10. Just getting a rook piercing. I'm really tempted to get this one. Look how pretty that one is. I'm really tempted to get that one. 
Ceux-là, ils sont trop petits, ça là. This is what I have now. Look at that. La lune has been hacking. La lune. Aisha's tempted to get a piercing. But I've had on there before. Yeah, but if you get it done professionally, I feel like it was me that pierced you, wasn't it? <laughs> Look at the art. Oh. He's so beautiful. Oh my God. How long you take to bath her? Him? Is that twice a year we bath? Oh, that's oh, quite good. Okay. Oh. Hi. Hi. Oh. Hi. Okay, we're gonna try the Princess Alice Hospice. Got some options here. To buy my song. Oh my God, this you know for work. But 15 pounds, I can't justify that. 15 pounds. Can I leave, Mama? Okay, there wasn't much in that charity shop. Okay, so we're gonna go to a third and last charity shop. Hopefully, I get some luck there. But for now, I've only gotten one jumper. I feel like I need to find some more stuff. Okay, Cancer Research UK in Kingston. Let's. Wish me luck, this is the last one we're gonna try. This would have been a good one, but it's Uniqlo for £6.50, but I don't see myself wearing that. They have some good bits here, to be honest, but it's just like, it's not my size available. My mum would love this. I'm gonna call her now. Got a few bits. This damsel in a dress, and but there's just like a rip in it here, so I'm gonna leave that. How cute are these cups? £7.50. I'm tempted. I think that's me done for the charity shop. Um, I'm a bit gutted about my uh, ear piercing. The lady said that it's not like healed properly, so she was just like, wait another six months and then like invest in a good piercing so i'm just gonna have to wait um but in terms of like charity shops i bought a few bits so i'll show you once i'm home i'm getting some what is this i thought this boost this is not even boost we've got berry buzz all right guys it's been a long day and i wanted to show you guys what i've got to be honest, I only got like three items. I mean, it's not like I needed a bunch of things, but I just wanted to see what there was out there because I haven't done a thrift shop in ages. Um, I did find some good pieces, especially for my mom. Like she found a, a few bits, but I feel like I need to do this video again. If you guys enjoyed it, I should do it again, but like in the like top charity shops in London or something. Um, the first thing that I got from, this was from the first charity shop, was this TU Woman jumper. This literally looks like it's barely been worn. An oversized jumper, this is size 18. I got it for £5.15. The second charity shop was a joke. There wasn't anything there and I did find that shirt, but it was like £14. I was like, it had stains on it as well. I was just like, I can't, I know it's for charity, but I might as well just go to one of the retail shops and just get a brand new shirt for that price, you know what I mean? In the third one, I did get a bit more luck, that's where we found the most things, but I picked up two uh, items. There were a lot of things that I wanted, but um, it was just not in my size. They had some really good stuff, to be honest, and it was packed. So I found this oversized shirt, like crop shirt, I think this on a pair of jeans. So this I got for 5 95 size 20 from Dorothy Perkins it feels really nice quality and to be honest I like oversized stuff so I'm loving that and then the final item which again like I'm quite happy this is from Zara it's like a an oversized shirt I feel like on those really like if I'm running errands and I just need to pop this on top of you know on, with leggings Zara basics 
size M, and I got this for six pounds. Zara for six pounds. Since when? Since when? So yeah, those were the three items I spent, guys. I'm pretty happy. Let me know if you guys want me to do another one of these. This was four pounds, but it's so good. Like the pink Django fruit has no taste whatsoever. But this, do you know what? Let's cut it open. I've been wanting to do this video for so long and I finally got around to doing it. You you can really find some gems because I've seen other thrift shop videos and they find like the coolest things, but uh, I didn't have that much luck today, let's just say. And it was in a specific area, Kingston upon Thames in the London area. So I could go more central maybe. It doesn't feel, it doesn't feel ready. Oh wait. Wait a minute. Oh my god. I'm telling you, if you can find a red dragon fruit near you. Oh, it's beautiful. It's just so good. It's like sweet. It has taste. Four pounds though. Four pounds. I'm just let me just let me just savor every every pence. I'm going to save this for later and savour it. I'm going to put it in the fridge. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely let me know in the comments below if you guys want another video like this. Don't forget to check out the HelloFresh link in the info box. Please make sure to like and leave a comment below. Do engage guys because it really helps your girl out. Because YouTube has been a bit... It's a bit rough these days, but nevertheless, thank you so much for all your support because if it weren't for you guys, I wouldn't be getting these kind of collaboration opportunities. So I am forever thankful to you guys. I really appreciate the love and support throughout the years. And yeah, just thanks so much for stopping by to watch my video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.